Let's go on a field trip with Katie's Classroom. Let's visit the library. The end. <laughs> Hi, friends. I'm glad you're here. Can you guess where we are? We're at the library, the Halton Hills Public Library in Georgetown, Ontario. Have you been to a library before? There's probably one close to where you live. Libraries have lots and lots of books, like this one right here. <laughs> it's also a place where you can spend time reading and learning. They're a very special and important part of any town, and they're one of my very favorite places. Well, I just finished reading this book, and now I need something new to read, so why don't you come along with me and we can look at the books together? Let's go. There's so many books to choose from. All of these books mostly have pictures in them and they're perfect for our friends who don't really know how to read yet. Ooh. <laughs> At this library, there are over 7,000 picture books. <laughs> but there's also storybooks and books that can help you learn how to read. And once you can read, there's so many other things you can explore, like novels and magazines and graphic novels. There's books about different topics and ideas, real things and imaginary things. There's so much stuff to read and it's all right here at the library. Sometimes I come to the library and I'm looking for something in particular. It might be a certain book or maybe I want to learn something about a topic. And if I don't know where to find it among all these books, then I can search for it on the library's computer. I'll show you. So here on the computer, you can search for a book by title or by author. The author is the name of the person that wrote the book. And you can also search by topic. Let's see. Well, I really like cats and I'd love to learn more about them. So let's search for that. C-A-T-S, cats. And these are all the books this library has that has to do with cats. <laughs> There's story books about cats and picture books about cats and information books about cats. <laughs> Let's see. Ooh, this one looks interesting. And we can find it with this. Each book in the library has a special code called a call number. A call number is kind of like the book's address in the library. It tells you where you can find it. So we'll write this one down. 636.8 M-A-C-L. And it says it's available, so that means it's on the shelf. Let's go find it. Hmm. Ah, it's down here. Let's see. 636. 636. Here it is! <laughs> we found it! <laughs> Let's take a look. Ooh. <laughs> So once you pick out your books, there's lots of places where you can read right here at the library. There's usually a spot where you can sit and read or study or just hang out. 
But if you have a library card, then you can check out the books and borrow them. So that means you can take them home and read them there. This is my library card. It's got my name on it. <laughs> and you can probably get a library card from the library that's close to you. It's really neat. It's kind of like making a promise to the library. You promise to look after the books and to return them when they're due so other people can have a turn with them too. And speaking of returning books, I have to return the book that I borrowed. I'll show you how you can do it. This is kind of my favorite part. Yeah? <laughs> Let's go. I could return the book inside, but this is more fun. The drop-off box. You can use this to return your library books without having to go inside. So it's really easy. Just open it up, put in the book, and there it goes. Isn't that neat? I wonder where they go though. What's down there? Hi, Katie. Oh, hi, Danny. <laughs> Friends, this is Danny. She's the children's librarian here at the Halton Hills Public Library. So nice to meet you all. <laughs> Katie, what are you doing? Uh, I was yeah. just looking down the books <laughs> here. I've always wondered where the books go. Ah, well, if you want to come on inside the library, I can give you a behind the scenes tour. That would be amazing. All right, let's go. <laughs> Welcome. This is the back part of the library where all of our librarians and other library staff work. And behind this door right here is where the books get returned. Do you want to take a peek? I would love to. I've always wondered what happens behind this door. All right, let's look. Okay. Ta-da! Whoa, that's a big pile of books. It sure is. Wow, and that's the slot that we saw from outside. That's right. Whoa, oh. Here comes a book now! Wow! <laughs> That's very cool. It is. So about once a day when this bin gets full, one of our library staff will come and take it. They go all the way upstairs, they check the books in, and then they put them back on the shelves by their call number. The books get placed on carts that then go to the different sections of the library, where they're placed back on the shelf in the right spot so that other people can find them and enjoy them. Wow, that is a lot of books to keep track of. It is. But... Most libraries have way more than just books. At this library, we have games, movies, audiobooks, backyard explorer kits, activity kits, and even personal flotation devices. And there's even more for you to enjoy while you're still here. There's video games, sensory kits, a VHS to DVD converter. We have printers, 3D printers, and vinyl cutters. There's all sorts of programs and events here for all ages. And the best part is, they're all free. That is amazing. Wow, libraries have so much to offer. I was just gonna borrow a couple books, but now I wanna check out some of those other things that you were talking about. For sure, go ahead. They're all there for you to use. Just be sure to bring them back when they're due so that other people can enjoy them too. Yes, of course I will. <laughs> well, thank you so much for showing us this part of the library. This was very cool to see. Yeah, of course. <gasps> <laughs> more books! <laughs> more books! <laughs> well, enjoy the rest of your time at the Halton Hills Public Library. Thanks, Danny. All right, friends, let's go find some things to borrow. Bye! Bye. <laughs> All right, so I have to return all these items in two weeks' time. 
But until then, I can enjoy them at home, reading and playing. How amazing is that? <laughs> Libraries really are incredible places, and I feel very lucky that I have such a great one in my town. And I hope you can check out the library that's close to you and take advantage of all it has to offer. And it's probably a lot. Well, I got a lot of reading and playing to do. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with me at the library. They're definitely one of my very favorite places. I'll see you again soon. Bye.